Welcome back to DIY No Need to Cry with Ivelisse. What do you get when you mix pastel roses, butterflies, pearls, and hollow glitter? You requested it. It's this spring bling bottle that is sure to catch anyone's eye. DIY spring bling bottle decor with butterflies, roses, and glitter. A quick reminder to please turn on your notification bell so that you can get notified as soon as I upload a video. Let's get started. Using a pouncer brush and matte white acrylic paint, paint the whole bottle and let it dry. Now give it as many coats of the metallic pearl white acrylic paint until you are satisfied. I gave it two coats, letting it dry between each one. Once it's completely dry, I sealed mine with polycrylic, a water-based sealer. You can use whatever clear sealer you have or give the whole bottle a coat of Mod Podge. While that's drying, let's get started on the cork. I used a foam ball and a plastic champagne cork to create it. Using the plastic cork, I made an imprint on the ball so that I know where to hollow out. Using an X-Acto knife, hollow out a little at a time until you can fit the cork inside the foam ball. Or jam a butter knife into it until the cork fits. <laughs> Now hot glue the cork into the foam ball. I gave the ball a coat of the metallic pearl paint and let that dry. While the bottle and cork are drying, let's prepare the last of the embellishments. Take some toothpicks and paint the tips with white paint. As you see, I stuck them on a foam ball to dry. I had two of these pearl necklaces in my stash. I cut all the pearls out and removed all the string. Using the hot glue gun, I glued the pearls onto the toothpicks as you see here. Be careful not to burn yourself when doing this part. I'm crazy. I'd rather burn myself as long as the glue isn't all over the place. <laughs> Do this to all of them. It's time to cover the whole ball with the clay roses I made in a previous video. The link to that video is in the description box below along with the butterfly one. Using the hot glue gun, glue the roses until the ball is covered. This was like putting together a puzzle. I had to find and position roses that fit well together. Don't glue it down until you are 100% sure you have it the way you want it. Once that's done, stick the pearls into any space that has too much of a gap. Some you might have to cut because of the plastic cork inside. And that's it for the cork. Now it's time to decorate the bottle. Take the rest of the roses and glue them on the same way you did to the cork, puzzling them together until you have the look you want. When you glue the roses onto the bottle, make sure to put the glue directly on the roses so you don't make a mess on the bottle. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, this took a long time to make because you have to take your time positioning every rose and I was also making sure not to put the same colors next to each other.
Once you're done, glue on the butterflies where you want them. As with the roses, don't glue them down until you know exactly where you want them. I then added antennas. And dots to the wings with liquid pearls. Lastly, add all the pearls to the roses on the bottle. You'll have to cut the toothpick for this part. Just like with the cork, glue them wherever you see there's too big of a gap. Here it is, all done. I love how this one came out. It took me so long to make, but it was well worth it. I absolutely made my vision come to life with this one. I'm not even gonna front though. I messed up about five times. I didn't know what direction I was going with the roses at first, so I had to pull them off and do the whole bottle over and over again. <laughs> That's why I said to make sure you know where you want them and have an execution plan before gluing them down permanently. This bottle would be amazing as a gift. It is perfect for a spring decor or make it only two colors with a sign hanging from the inside of the cork that shows it's a boy or a girl when you pull it up for a baby reveal party. Instead of butterflies, you could do a baby, stork, baby bottle, or diapers. So many ways I could think of to customize it to whatever occasion, theme, or holiday. As always, have fun, be creative, and make a mess. I hope you enjoyed this one. Even though it took me a long time, I'm so happy with this one. Thank you for this request. It really took me out of my comfort zone and challenged me. Thanks for watching. If you liked this video, please don't forget to thumbs it up as it helps the growth of the channel and to show your support. If you're new here, I hope you consider subscribing to get updates on future videos. And remember, do it yourself. There's no need to cry.